Welcome back. Houston has its fair share of forward-thinking entrepreneurs. Of course, we know that. Yes, and we this do. month's Houston Magazine is putting them in the spotlight. Publisher Peter Remington and special guest Ray Dennison are here with a preview. Thank you, gentlemen, for joining us. So Thank excited! You. To have Thanks you. for having us. It's great. So, Peter, tell us a little bit about our special guest. Well, our special. Okay. This is Ray Dennison. Ray Dennison is a new editor at Houston Magazine. He's been with the magazine for two years, and we had an opening, and we were able to promote from within inside of the company and here That's he is. Amazing. Yeah. Oh my gosh, congratulations. So Ray, tell us about the forward thinking entrepreneur section of the magazine. Well, we all know Houston is a town full of awesome startups and brilliant people. So we went out into the community and found um, six great people with really clever new ideas that are starting to affect Houston and hopefully are going to grow not only here but also across the country. So we've got a couple of startup app founders. Um, we've got somebody who's got a very clever organic snack food brand that's in Whole Foods now. So check Check it out and get some good ideas. It might just be the next big thing. Yeah, exactly. I'm so excited, and that's amazing. So, and Peter, what else can people find? Because I'm sure there's a lots of fun stuff, and there's, that's always what the magazine is about. There's always something new. There's always different. something. That's the great thing about Houston Magazine. That's a great thing about Ray, because he's bringing a lot of great ideas to the magazine as well. But uh, you're gonna find we did a great article on Daniel Radcliffe and his new movie coming up, which is uh, Now You See Me Too. And then we also have a section there called The Source. And The Source is all about new businesses here or the local businesses here and so forth. And then uh, our restaurant reviews and fashion and all the great things that are going on. But tell us what else is new on the evening scene. Well, you know, River yeah. Oaks District is starting to pop. All those restaurants are oh, starting to open yes. up. So you have Toulouse that's opened up. Uh, Steak 48 is opening up this week, I believe. That's as a matter of fact it is. And then uh, Le Colonial, excuse me, it's kind of like a brewery. <laughs> That word, <laughs> so uh, is opening up. So there's a lot of great things, and also in the month of June we have our bridal book coming out. So if anything's oh, going on with the yes. ladies out there and they're getting engaged, you want to go see our bridal magazine. It'll we be on the it. stands in, in mid June as well. And you know what? That's what I love about Houston. When I came here, it was the food. I mean, yeah. really. The food. We love the food, and there's so many different places, right? There are. It's a showcase. Yeah, and as a matter of fact, one that's the Steady Eddie in Houston, which is Hugo's, is written up in our magazine as well. And he, what he's doing over there at his restaurant, because that's a that's a fun place to go to. So much fun. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so much. Fun for having for having you guys on the show. And you can find all this information and check out a replay of this interview at clicktohouston.com. It'll be posted under our video tab on our homepage a little after the show. Get your magazine. Get it fast. Run, don't walk. Run. <laughs> <laughs>